I'm turning this old gamble oak log into a goblet because it's finally time for us to return to our chokeberry wine. After a secondary ferment, it was time to bottle, which went flawlessly. Oh no, no! Ah! Before giving it a taste, let's head to the wood shop and grab a piece of oak, whose relationship with wine goes back thousands of years when after using things like animal skins and clay pots, people started upgrading to storing wine in barrels, which made things a lot more efficient. Oak became the wood of choice for this as it was strong and pliable and soon people started to notice that oak was adding all sorts of flavor and complexity to the wine. And while we still age wine in oak barrels today, many wineries have actually switched to using toasted oak chips as a cost saving measure. Oh, and just to clear up some confusion from part one of this video, this wine was made from choke berries, also called aronia berries, which are different from choke cherries. So anyway, I'm really eager to give this aronia wine a taste. So let's grab our lovely oak goblet and cut to the chase. Ooh, choke-tastic. 